Hello everybody, welcome to JK Special Creations. Today my mom, Jyoti's special recipe is Aloo Paratha. Aloo Paratha is a popular North Indian dish. It can be eaten as a healthy breakfast and it is a whole meal on itself. It is a mouth-watering dish and tastes really good. Let's get into the recipe. First, my mom took 3 cups of wheat flour and added some salt to it. And gradually she added a little bit of water and kneaded the dough. After that she added a tablespoon of oil and mixed the dough really well until it becomes smooth. Then she kept it aside for 15 minutes. After that, she took boiled and peeled potatoes, 500 grams of it, and added salt and chili powder, each 1 tablespoon. After that, she added half tablespoon of turmeric powder and 1 tablespoon of garlic and ginger paste. She also added 1 tablespoon of garam masala and half tablespoon of ajwain to it. Then she mashed these potatoes and mixed them really well so that no lumps are formed. To this mashed potato, she added some chopped onions, green chilies and coriander leaves. She mixed all of them together well and added 1 tablespoon of cumin seeds. She mixed all of that again and covered them and put it aside. After 15 minutes, she took this dough and added 1 tablespoon of ghee to it. You can see how the dough is really smooth and is crack free. Kneading the dough in this manner does not make it stick to your hands and looks very smooth and will make a very good paratha out of it. She took this dough and made small balls out of it. She took some atta on the plate for the dough. Then she put it on the rolling pan and flattened the dough a little. She scooped out a little of the mashed potatoes that we kept aside and put it on the middle of the dough and pulled it on the sides and covered it, making a ball. She then pinched off the excess dough. She patted all of it, removed the excess flour from it and then she rolled it into a paratha. She then placed this rolled paratha onto a hot pan to cook it. It's important that the paratha is cooked on both the sides so that the stuffing inside is also cooked well. She rubbed some ghee on the paratha so that it can cook very nicely and give a very good taste. She made sure that the paratha is cooked very well on both the sides. You can see how lovely it looks. So your aloo paratha is ready and it is hot. Serve it hot and enjoy it with your friends and family. You can have it with curd or 
as any side of your choice with pickle or ketchup. If you like this recipe, please do not forget to hit the like button and share it with all your friends and family. We would love to see your comments as well in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Bye-bye and take care.